hey i know y'all surprised to see my face over here on this channel but as you can see we didn't change the channel once again child i know i know this channel right here i'm pretty sure is here to stay so we decided to change this channel into disney vlogs so i'm a vlog over here every time we go to disney anything disney related and universal we can't leave out universal i love disney i love some mickey my husband cleveland loves disney as well he loves star wars so that's where we are on our way off to hollywood studios that's where star wars is at he has a reservation or appointment to build a light light saver so yeah hollywood studios is where we're off to the park opened at 9. His reservation is at 1045, so we plan on being there at 9. Just about to touch up my edges real quick. And oh, let me show y'all how I got this little, or how I got my hair to stand up like this. I took a piece of um, braid in here, the kinky braid in here, and I just wrapped it around, as y'all can see, so it can kind of you know stand up a little bit I just took one one piece all right show y'all what I got on real quick nothing special just the basic old Hollister long sleeve shirt because it's kind of cool right now it's only 53 degrees but it's supposed to warm up to 80 I could bring a jacket but I don't have a jacket that would match you know like a solid mickey jacket <laughs> that will match the backpack i'm wearing today so this is the backpack i'm wearing today i haven't wore her in a long time so i decided to bring her out and i just got on some all black leggings with some red harachis oh i can go put on my little mickey earrings that i bought from this website called babble bar i think it is yeah let's go do that gotta make sure i take my vitamins just take my prenatal vitamins <laughs> i ain't pregnant i just like taking these because it's like a lot of different vitamins in one and then i'm just going to be taking some sea moss now how i'm supposed to get past uh, it just turned on I, I ain't trying to get wet i ain't about to come out here okay so cleveland turn turn them off <laughs> to let the queen walk through <laughs> Okay, so we at the gas station. We're about to stop at Starbucks and no, I am not about to get no refresher. I know it may be, maybe one or two of y'all are just seeing my face for the first time and y'all know who the heck I am. My name is Javon. I do have another channel, a vlogging, a family vlogging channel. And like I told y'all in the beginning, this was our family channel, not necessarily vlogging, but we did like different challenges, bake-offs and you know, stuff like that. Kind of grew away from that because my kids kids has gotten older you know how when kids get older they don't want to have nothing to do with you so my husband took over the channel for maybe a month he was doing his own little thing and he fell off he's not really a camera person he's gotten a lot better but he's not really a camera person so yeah my name is Javon I am 40 years old I just turned 40 last year and I'm just enjoying life honey I'm just enjoying life I love Disney we moved from we moved to Florida from Ohio about four years ago if you want to check out those vlogs like I said you can head over to my vlogging channel or my other vlogging channel I do have a daughter Janiah she's 12 she loves Disney as well she usually is with us but like I said he has an appointment to make that to build that lightsaber and you can only include one other person in there with you so um but yeah if you think you're going to enjoy the channel I would appreciate if you subscribe like I said it's going to be a lot of Disney related things over here some universal Disney Springs. Um, I know a lot of y'all like to come here on vacation, so I hope I can help y'all plan y'all vacation a little easier. So this is my husband, Cleveland. We've been married for 22 years. We just had an anniversary December 22nd. So yeah, this is the Star Wars fan. Yep. And this is the reason why we headed to Disney today. He loved Disney. He just, he ain't gonna never admit it, but. I don't see I love Disney. I don't like. I don't care about no Mickey Mouse and all that crap. <laughs> don't 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 do Mickey. If Disney, don't if, do. If Star Wars wasn't at Disney, I would just go because you go. Awesome. Okay, so we had to. Oh. So we had to come to Target Starbucks because the Starbucks on the way was way too crowded. But I love some pistachio. I just got a Royal English Black Tea. 
uh, short. I don't need that much. I didn't get no kind of sugar or anything in it, which I usually drink my teas raw. I don't even add, I don't even be adding honey sometimes. Sometimes I do, but most of the time I don't. So this is what the lines usually look like when you get here before the park opens. So it's 8.55, we got five minutes. Alright, so I'm trying to go to Savvy's workshop and she's trying to look for a ride. Remember what she said? We came here so he can go to Star Wars. That's the only reason why we're here. Now, she's looking for a ride because my appointment ain't till 1030. 45. I mean, you sure? Yeah. I think we better look at the email because I don't want to be late. I got I to gotta get my lightsaber so I can continue to be one with the force. So, what, what you trying to get on? I was going to say we might as well get on the Star Wars ride. Oh, yeah, but sometimes that... If it's like 40 minutes, because it's only 909 right now. Yeah, yeah. I'm trying, I'm trying to see how it's the wait time right now. Yeah, so yeah, I think we should go that way, right? Remember yeah. we messed up last time. Yeah, go that way first, because it's quicker to go. Look, That's where all them people... Running to. Yeah, it's like a big crowd of people run, like speed walking trying to get over there. Well, hey, I get it, because if you're here on vacation, yeah, you, you got a limited yeah. time, and you're trying to ride a, a, ride, a popular ride, hey, you're going to be speed yeah, look, walking. Look, look how they... Yeah. we used to do it. Yeah. <laughs> we used to do it. But now, now we don't even care. <laughs> but now it still make me mad, because I don't want to wait that long, but yeah. whatever. Because <laughs> last time it kept breaking down, and we had to wait. So good. I'm hungry. So... Star Wars Rise of the Resistance is what the proper name for it. I always say the Star Wars ride. Oh. But yeah, it's temporarily closed. Uh, Rock and Roller Coaster is temporarily closed. And Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railroad is temporarily closed. Everything else is pretty much up and running. And here are the current wait times. We are in Star Wars land. Uh, it's called Batu. Okay. <laughs> She said it's down for technical diff difficulty. Y'all, y'all see this bag right here? It is so cute, but that mug is $300. That 50 Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's so freaking pretty. It's opening. Oh. Uh, we was just about to, nah, I'm straight. Y'all, we was just about to walk past. Yeah. <laughs> now they just opened. I don't think we would have that far to go. If that's the beginning of the line. Yeah. Right. That turned out good because we about to go to the bathroom. She was about to go to the bathroom. You was going to come with me. Yeah, because I can't just leave. Yeah, that is the I did it like a middle school. I went to the bathroom before we came. What the heck was knocking the thing over? Please report back to IGS carpet. Be 
BB-8. Is everyone assembled? Good. Shouldn't you be in flight prep? Recruits, thank you for joining the cause. A covert resistance team led by my friend Finn has infiltrated a First Order Star Destroyer that is now headed to this system. Your outpost on Batu is no longer safe. We have transports waiting to take you to General Organa's secret base on Pakara. I'll regroup with you there. The Resistance desperately needs your help in our fight against Kylo Ren and the First Order. Remember, it is vital that you keep the location of the Pakara base secret. Lieutenant Beck, one of our top commanders, will lead you. Good. Thank you, Lieutenant. Welcome to the cause. May the Force be with us. Commander Pearl Dameron and a squadron of X-Wings shall escort us to the rendezvous point on Dukara. Roger, this is Black Leader. I hear you're a fine-looking group of recruits. Well, no time to waste. Let's get you on your way to the General. Stand clear. That is in motion. Recruits crossing to transport. There appear to be a number of small craft heading our way. Raise the shields. We got company. First order TIE fighters. We're up. We're up. We got company. First order TIE fighters. We're up. We're up. Disembark all ship immediately and proceed down to the hallway on the right for processing. Everyone off the ship. Now! Not back up. Go! Now! <laughs> Come on, man. Which way? Oh, Charles, this way. LS 9.6 and Torplex replacement equipment to remain with audience until further notice. How many do you Two. 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 How many do you have? Single file on along this wall. Do not lean on. Single file line on the line. Yes, General. Enemies of the First Order, we will soon snuff out your meager resistance. You chose the wrong side, and now you will pay. The resistance prisoners. You have what I want. You know the location of the secret base, and I will take it from you. We are needed on the bridge. Keep the prisoners here. I will return to finish this personally. Securely fastened. <laughs> the probe droid. You're lucky at Wait, the ghost of the prisoner! Cover is blown! Find an Now! Found the alarm! All personnel to their stations! Sir, the prisoners have 
are brave, but ultimately hopeless. There's nowhere to run. So Rise of the Resistance was fun. We had a little breakdown, but we made it through in time. She got to run to the bathroom real quick before we go to uh, Savvy's workshop. Should be one near here so I can get this lightsaber build. I don't even know what hill I'm picking. I don't know nothing yet. I, or color crystal I'm picking, nothing. I'll figure it out when I get in there. Savvy's working. We gotta check in right here. Okay. And then you're gonna hang out straight back under the awning by the wall over here. Okay. Uh, Aaron will be with you in a minute. Okay. Right. Okay, so. Yeah, which lightsaber? This says peace and justice. This says power and control. Elemental nature. Protection and defense. Which one do you like this style? I like this one. Yeah, I like because it's got like um, leather on it and all that. This basically the dark side. This the light side, or not the light side, but the Jedi. This this the Jedi also. So you, so FYI guys, you don't have to make an appointment to actually get a lightsaber. You can actually buy one. What's the last name? Beard. Beard. Thank you. All right, just to let you know, we are out of the black sheets that come complimentary with the experience. Sorry, our deliveries were hijacked by pirates. I mean, you know how it is in the outer yeah. rims. We get some shady characters in space. Right, so I will have to buy one then. Yes, if you want to, or you can have it delivered to your home. We do offer that. Oh, okay. So later they'll deliver it? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. You can do that at either Droid Depot or Rock On Dars. Okay. But as a sorry for the inconvenience, we are offering you a 10% discount on the experience. Oh, okay, cool. Okay. Uh, when you're ready, you can head up to the credit check. Oh, okay. Hi. Right here. Hi, travelers. Hello. Hi. I see a violet credential. You've come to the right place. Oh, protection and defense. Two, my personal favorite. What's the last name I'm looking for, my friend? Beard. Beard. Yes, there we are. All right. So come on in. Take a seat. Well, lost, but to us, this is everything. I see you've all met the gatherers. Very good. You may call me Kembe. Now, to some of you, this may look like a lot of old junk. But let me assure you, some of it, uh, well, it is new junk. <laughs> Thank you. Let me explain. We humbly call ourselves the Gatherers. We search the galaxy for ancient relics, abandoned places, forgotten outposts, and battle ravaged planets. What we find, we bring here to the workshop. So, we're a stormtrooper, they see worthless clutter. Those who know will see priceless history. And in these troubled times, preserving our past may ensure our future. You've heard the legend of Luke Skywalker. Yes? Yes. yes. Very good. Well, now we hear there is another, a new Jedi. Do you know her name? Ray. Ray, yes. And what she is leading is the spark of hope that we have been searching for for so long.
his saber has been wielded by some of our greatest heroes and darkest enemies. It's elegant and enigmatic to build a lightsaber is an art. The saber is the reflection of its builder with the force flowing between them. Today you will feel that connection. But enough talking. Let's begin. We begin with perhaps the most important part of the lightsaber, the kyber crystal, able to focus the energy of the force, to magnify it. Some say the kyber crystal is the heart of the lightsaber. The color of the crystal determines the color of the lightsaber's blade. The blue crystal, like the one wielded by Obi-Wan Kenobi, his apprentice Anakin Skywalker, and now Rey. Breathe. Qui Gon Jinn, Ahsoka Tano, Master Yoda himself, and Luke Skywalker. The violet crystal, rare and beautiful, like the one wielded by Mace Windu. And red, the color of power, the crystal of Darth Maul, Asajj Ventress, Darth Vader, and now Kylo Ren. But these are the stories of the past, and we're here for you, our future. It's now time to select your Kylo crystal. Everyone, close your eyes to me. Close your eyes. In your mind, picture your crystal. What color? Do you see what color calls for you now? Open your eyes and take your crystal. Whoops, I think one dropped it. Pretty good. You've all selected your crystal. Now, if you would, please place it on the green crystal holder in front of you. Stabilize your crystal for activation. This must be done with great care, skill, and timing. That's why this part is being undertaken by our highly skilled gatherers. Very good. It's time. Master Yoda, it is indeed time to take that first step. The bond between Saber and Builder is about to be forged. In a moment, on my signal, everyone will take a step forward. Place their hand on their hilt, and together, on my command, you will activate for the first time. Are you ready? Yes. Then step forward, head to the side. Place your hand on your hilt. And activate. Builders! Raise your lightsabers! Hold them high! You have built a lightsaber like the Jedi and Sith who came before you and like they you too can change the galaxy. He wants one of these things so bad. <laughs> like he's legit mad that he wasn't gonna be able to carry around this thing. That's pretty sweet. It's better quality than the one that they give you for free? Yeah, the one they give you for free is just like a little black sleeve for you to put it in. It so it's um, $49.99. Oh, you have an annual pass? Yep, yep, that's what I was trying to. Thank you so much. Forty-two fifty-nine today, my friend. Alrighty. Cargo slip and your scrap metal. Take care. Gift shops, about 
the entrance because we about to head out. We're gonna go to Epcot, but we can't park pop until two. It's 11 14, so we about to go find something to do. I wonder what days are like this. I'm about to take a picture of it. Oh, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. Mickey's coming. We decided to come to Epcot. I mean, why not? It's not yet two o'clock. It's one. Uh -oh, hold on. I'm getting my steps in. One fifty-five. By the time we get up there, it'll be two o'clock. I fall for you every time I try to resist We can get away I'm just bitch feels in an every day All I wanna hear is an every single we play Staring next to you So they still got these walls up everywhere. I don't know when they're scheduled to be taken down, but I'm tired of looking at them. <laughs> I'm tired of seeing them. And plus we can't do our little shortcuts and stuff to, you know, certain rides. All right, y'all, we never come back here. Well, we did one time and got on this ride, Mission Space, never again. That was years ago when we was here on vacation. Never again. Yeah, rookies, yeah. Yes. Oh my goodness. That's the worst ride ever. I thought I was about to die. That ride so they got something to your blood. Yeah. Like, make all the blood but rush to your, your head. And head like it's, it's, it's the like, worst ride ever. Oh, and they also opened up a new restaurant called Space 220. That opened really up a couple months ago, but Is you know, it? it's hard to. Those people are waiting in line to get in to the lounge. Oh, okay. Which is a little cheaper. Okay, so Next you don't need a res. Well, is it hard getting a reservation? We got one this morning. Oh, really? Yeah, the lounge doesn't need mm -hmm. it, but it's just as soon as it comes available, they take you back. Oh. But you can always go check and see if somebody right. canceled. They had some open tables in there. Oh, okay, cool. thank you. Pretty expensive. Right. <laughs> well, that's Disney, it's Disney, so. so yeah. <laughs> But it was very one time, and it was yeah. it was very good. Oh, okay, so, so it's really it cool in there. Yeah, yeah it is. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> all right. Thank you. Thanks. All right. Goodness, uh, yeah, let's look at the menu. menu. Yeah, we're gonna have to come back. I didn't know that you can just kind of like walk up, and she said you can go to like the lounge part. Mm -hmm. But I guess it was that burrito. I don't know. Ooh, they got a red snapper. That's what I would get right here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna have to try and come back here one. Frozen is down this way, and it might not be a long of a line. Let's see how long Frozen is, because usually Frozen be wrapped all the way around here. It say seventy minutes, not seventy. Yeah. How is that 70? And usually the line be way back there, wrapped around for about 70 minutes. I swear, but. Basically, at the ride, when you get a couple things, how is it 70 minutes? Is it broke down or something? I don't know, but we ain't about to stand in it. Some workers be walking around with a little broom, a wet broom, and drawing the characters. I guess it'll be Donald Duck. Oh, it's Mickey. Oh, that's a uh, daisy. Okay, he's taking too long. He's talking about he need more water. He ain't got no more. And <laughs> I don't know, but I think it was Donald. So the Ratatouille ride is back there, but it's still, as of today, virtual. So you have to make a reservation. But probably about 10 minutes ago, I was complaining about it. I was talking to Cleveland. I'm like, can't ride still virtual. They need to make it regular, like a standby line. And then a worker came up from behind me. She was like, in two days, two days, they changing it to standby. So <laughs> FYI, they changing it to standby in two days. 
No more virtual. I think that virtual is so stupid. I mean, I get why they do it, but all right, we about to head into this creation shop which is the big gift shop here at Epcot. It used to be called Mouse Gear. It's a thousand dollars, I've seen that. What is it, it's one of them hats? Yeah. Luxury logo jewel. I like this sweatshirt though. Yeah, I can fit that, that's an extra large. Or should I get a large? Cause I am in a process of losing weight. So it may be my little, little motivation. Not really, but y'all get what I'm saying. Let me see what this large talking about. Mmm, do this stretch? It stretch a little bit, huh? Uh-oh. I don't know, y'all. So I got the shirt in a size large as well. I got some Dooney and Burke bags over here. This is cute. This is kind of small. This one, the wallets. The backpacks is two sixty eight, and the little totes are two ninety eight. This is cute. I'm just really attracted to this one because it's blue. But this little one is two sixty eight. This one's cute. That one's two sixty eight, and the wallets are one fifty. Y'all, they got that bag. Should I get it? Yeah, I am seriously thinking about getting this bag. I'm seriously thinking about it. We get a discount? <laughs> no, I'm just basically thinking, oh, no surprises here then. You what? Know, look, y'all, he said he was gonna surprise me with this bag and I just messed it up. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. She don't give you enough time to get nothing. Yeah. So. I don't want it to be so oh like let me let's get into it y'all let's get into this bag like this right here is not plastic like look at it it's beautiful it's so beautiful I feel bad now I'm gonna also get this pop socket for my phone Cleveland was like, people still use these? I don't know. I'm, I'm going to use it. I don't care. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty. I told Cleveland I would want that as an accent wall for like a, a Mickey What's room. I don't know. Baby right. Yoda. <laughs> that's what they call him, but that ain't his name. He eating that eggs. These are some frog eggs. They had to take this frog to a different planet mm. to meet her husband so she can lay her eggs because that would be the last offspring. Mm. If she don't lay those eggs, mm -hmm. then they wouldn't, they hold, they wouldn't exist anymore. Mm. And he kept eating them. <laughs> Do you have a discount? Yeah, we have an annual pass. Oh, you already did the discount? Yes, I applied the discount. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was about to show you my card. No. <laughs> All right, thanks. Let me get my Apple Pay? Yes. All right, we got the goods. It came up to two forty six because annual pass and I had a gift card that Cleveland gave me for Christmas. Oh, don't know what this is gonna be. But it's supposed to be a couple new rides opening this year and next year, I believe. Here's the monorail. Goop. Oh, I thought you said you got this. I was oh. talking about the camera. All right, y'all, we about to end the vlog here. We had fun today. Cleveland got his lightsaber. Mm -hmm. I always say life. Right. I, I went and built a light, built yeah. a lightsaber. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I picked violet because that's the color of Mace Windu who is uh, Samuel Jackson. Like his is unique. They added that color just for Samuel Jackson. It's basically blue and red combined. That's why it's that violet color. So you good, but if you somebody make you mad, yeah, you kinda, <laughs> you kinda jack people up on the dark side part. But you're not like dark side, you're still on the good side. But it's like a combination of the red and the, and the blue. That's, so I think that fits you perfectly. Exactly, because I'm the <laughs> nicest person on earth. But if you cross that line, then you're gonna get the you're gonna get the 
the <laughs> default hood condition <laughs> gonna come out. Default so, hood. right, whatever the default hood action is, that's what you're gonna get. That's why I picked him. Plus, I like Mace Windu. So, so I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. Next, I think we're gonna go to Universal. We haven't been to Universal in a minute, so we're gonna take y'all along there. I want to go to Sea World too. Even though we don't have an annual pass for Sea World, if you don't know, we have an annual pass for Universal and Disney, not Sea World. But yeah, we may go to Sea World and check out some other parks around here. I don't know what's another one. We've been to Bush Gardens before in mm -hmm. Tampa. Uh, fun spot? I don't know. <laughs> fun spot to look a little carnivalish yeah, to me. Yeah, I do carnival you know, rides. And we don't care for the carnival, but who knows? So I got my bag. I'm so happy. And I didn't even know that that doggone pop socket was $50. Girl, it broke it down to $39.99. It took $10 off because of the discount. So yeah, we about to head up out of here. Like I said, if you enjoyed the video, please thumbs it up. Subscribe if you haven't and be on the look. I turn the notifications on because we will be posting other videos. I promise we're going to be active over here on this channel <laughs> because we go to Disney a lot. We go to Universal a lot and stuff like that. So we're definitely going to be active. We're going to have some content for y'all. All right, y'all. Bye.